In today's video, we're diving into a detailed review of Aweber, one of the veteran email marketing tools out there on the market today. We'll cover everything you need to know, from its features and pricing to its pros and cons. Plus, we'll discuss whether it's the right email marketing tool for you and your business. Now, if at any time you wanna get started with Aweber, there will be links down in the description to do so. Now, let's go ahead and get started. First, let's talk about the features. So Aweber provides a variety of tools designed to help you with your email marketing campaigns. Here are some of the key features that you can expect. Email newsletters and autoresponders. You can send both email newsletters and automated email sequences to your subscribers. Landing pages. Aweber includes a landing page builder, which is great for capturing leads without needing a separate website. Email automation. You can set up automated workflows to nurture your leads and customers. A-B testing. This feature allows you to test different email subject lines or content to see what performs better. Integrations. Aweber integrates with many other tools like Shopify, WordPress, and Zapier to name a few. One standout feature is the keep my content checkbox in the drag and drop email builder, which ensures that switching templates won't overwrite your existing content. And I think that's a pretty nice feature. Let's break down some of the features in more detail. Email newsletters and autoresponders. Aweber's email builder is user-friendly, offering a drag and drop interface that makes it easy to create professional looking emails. You can add images, videos, buttons, and various other elements to enhance your emails. The autoresponder functionality allows you to set up automated email sequences, ensuring that your subscribers receive timely and relevant content based on their actions or behaviors. Landing pages. Aweber's landing page builder is another powerful tool. You don't need to be a web design expert to create stunning landing pages. The builder comes with pre-designed templates that you can customize to match your brand. This feature is especially useful for creating pages, that capture leads or promote special offers. Email automation. Automation is where Aweber really shines. You can create complex workflows that automate your email marketing efforts. For instance, you can set up a welcome series for new subscribers, automate follow-up emails based on subscriber behavior, and even send personalized emails triggered by specific actions. This level of automation can save you a lot of time and help you engage with your audience more effectively. A-B testing. Testing is crucial for optimizing your email campaign campaigns. Aweber's A-B testing feature allows you to test different subject lines, email content, and send times to determine what works best for your audience. By analyzing the results, you can make data-driven decisions that improve your email performance. Integrations. Integrations are essential for a seamless workflow. Aweber integrates with numerous third-party tools, including e-commerce platforms like Shopify, content management systems like WordPress, and automation tools like Zapier. These integrations enable you to connect your email marketing with other parts of your business, creating a cohesive marketing strategy. Overall, Aweber offers a comprehensive set of features that cater to the needs of both beginners and advanced users. Now let's talk about Aweber's pricing, which offers a variety of plans to fit different needs from beginners to advanced creators. Free plan, cost is $0 per month, and the features you get are perfect for getting started with up to 500 subscribers included. You can send up to 3,000 emails per month with access to one email list, one landing page, and one email automation. This plan includes basic email support. Next up is the light plan, which costs $12.50 per month billed annually. And some of the features are it's ideal for those ready to upgrade their email game. You can send up to eight times your subscriber volume monthly with access to one email list, three landing pages, and three email automations. This also includes 24-7 support. Next is the plus plan which starts at $20 per month billed annually. And it's designed for creators looking to scale their business. You can send up to 12 times your subscriber volume monthly with unlimited lists, unlimited landing pages, and unlimited email automations. Plus you'll get priority 24 seven support. Lastly, there's the unlimited plan at $8.99 per month when billed annually. This is for those with extensive email needs. And you can send up to 15 times your subscriber volume monthly with unlimited lists, landing page, and email automations. This plan also includes personalized account management. For those with even larger needs, Aweber offers custom plans tailored to subscribers over 100,000 people. If this is you, go ahead and contact Aweber directly at one 877 
293-2371 for personalized pricing. So no matter where you are in your email marketing journey, Aweber has a plan to fit your needs. So let's compare this to other tools. MailChimp, for example, has a free plan that allows 2,000 contacts, but with limited features. They have other paid plans that start at $9.99 per month. GetResponse has a free plan that includes up to 500 contacts with paid plans starting at $15 per month. And then there's Send in Blue, which also has a free plan and allows for unlimited contacts with a 300 emails per day limit. And those paid plans start at $25 per month. So Aweber's pricing is competitive at lower subscriber counts, but as your list grows, it can get quite expensive compared to some alternatives. Ease of use. Let's move on to the user experience. Aweber's dashboard is fairly easy to navigate. However, there are a few quirks. Newsletters are labeled as broadcasts. Automated workflows are found under campaigns. And it's important to pay attention to which list you're working with since everything associated with this specific list is in its own dashboard. This can help you stay organized, but might require a bit of getting used to. Creating a newsletter. To create a newsletter, click on Create Message. You have a number of options here, including a feature where Aweber creates a template based on your website. However, the drag and drop email builder is the most flexible option, allowing you to add various content elements like videos, products, coupons, and image carousels. You can also browse through design templates and customize the color palette to match your brand. Automation. Aweber offers several automation options, but the process can be a bit clunky. Many of the good automation templates need to be imported from the marketplace. For instance, you can find templates for Black Friday campaigns or abandoned cart automations from Shopify. To use these, you have to copy the sharing code and import the campaigns into your account. While this process isn't the most intuitive, the templates themselves are well designed and can save you a lot of time. Landing pages. Building landing pages with Aweber is quite straightforward. The landing page builder is more user friendly than the signup form builder, allowing you to create attractive pages without much hassle. You can choose from over 40 templates on the paid plan or start from scratch with the drag and drop builder. This feature is especially useful for creating dedicated pages to capture leads or promote special offers. Deliverability and customer support. Deliverability is a crucial factor for any email marketing tool. Unfortunately, Aweber doesn't perform as well in this area. According to various tests, Aweber's emails often end up in spam folders or fail to deliver to the primary inbox, scoring below averages in deliverability rates. This is something to keep in mind if you're considering Aweber for your email marketing needs. On the plus side though, Aweber does offer robust customer support. All plans, including the free one, come with phone support, which is rare among email marketing tools. You can also access email and live chat support, though wait times can be longer for free plan users. Aweber's customer service is generally responsive and helpful, making it easier to troubleshoot any issues that you might encounter. Now let's go ahead and take a quick tour of Aweber. So once you get signed in and you're signed up with the free Aweber account, this is what it's going to look like. So over here on the left-hand side, we have the quick menu, messages, automation, subscribers, pages and forms, list options, web push, reports, integration, and help. Let's go ahead and start by clicking on messages. So here, this is where we can start creating broadcast messages or our newsletter. So to start creating a message, we can cre click on one of the two create a message buttons. And by clicking that, we can either use the drag and drop editor, the smart designer, the plain text editor, or the custom HTML editor. Let's go ahead and take a look at the drag and drop editor for this example. So over here on the left hand side, we have a list of all the different elements that we can go ahead and add to our broadcast or newsletter message. So if we wanted to add things like text, image, a button, a divider, video, logo, or row, this is where you'd go ahead and find all of those different elements. When you go ahead and select any text, there are some other tools here that you can use to format your message. So you can go ahead and select the style of text, the font of the text, the size of the font, the line spacing, the font color, any highlight or background color. You have your bold, italic, underscore, and strike through options. You can link specific text. You can change your alignment and add different bulleted or numbered lists. You can also insert images here, add emojis, and personalize your message. To preview your message, you can go ahead and click up here and hit preview and test. And this way you can go ahead and see exactly what your email is going to look like before sending. And that's just a basic intro to the drag and drop editor inside of Aweber. To go ahead and look at your subscribers, go ahead and click on the subscribers over here on the left-hand side. And here we can go ahead and see all of our subscribers by date, either those added today, added since yesterday, added in the past seven days, past 30 days, 
and in the last year. We can also filter subscribers by engagement. So whether they're dormant subscribers, unengaged new subscribers, low engagement, moderate engagement, and high engagement, which can be very useful. Next, taking a look at pages and forms. So this is where we can create landing pages in sign up forms. So to create a landing page, just come over here and click on create a landing page. And from here, we can go ahead and select from any of these templates here. So what's really nice about Aweber is that you can go ahead and preview a template before choosing it. For example, uh, let's take a look at this one here. So we went ahead and just clicked on preview. And here we can sort of see exactly what it's going to look like on both desktop as well as mobile before committing to a template. So once you find a template that you like, you can go ahead and click on choose. So let's go ahead and just take a look at this one here. And now we are inside of the landing page builder where we can go ahead and start customizing this to our needs. So similar to the email builder over here on the left hand side, we have the different elements that we can go ahead and add into our landing page. Over here on the right hand side, we have some other settings and tools that we can use to go ahead and adjust each element further. So for example, here uh, with this heading here, we can go ahead and change the alignment, give it a border, change appearance like drop shadow corners, that type of stuff, as well as any individual spacing. And that was just a very basic intro to Aweber. Again, if you want to get started with Aweber, there are links down in the description to do so. Moving into the pros and cons. Every tool has its strengths and has its weaknesses, and Aweber is no exception. Here are some of the pros and cons based on our extensive review and user feedback. Now, some of the pros is its design flexibility. Aweber's drag and drop email builder is robust, offering plenty of design options, including video, products, coupons, and image carousels. And they have a free plan. The free plan allows up to 3,000 emails per month for 500 subscribers. Phone support, which is available on all plans, which is quite rare among email marketing tools. Automation features. While the setup can be clunky, Aweber offers a range of automation features that can help streamline your email marketing efforts. Landing page builder. User-friendly and comes with a variety of templates to choose from. Now, some of the cons. High pricing. So as your subscriber list grows, Aweber can become quite expensive. Limited features on lower plans. The light plan in particular is quite limited, lacking features like the ability to remove Aweber branding or advanced automation. Poor deliverability rates. So according to some tests conducted by various review sites, Aweber's deliverability rates are below average, which means emails may end up in the spam folders more often than with some other services on the market. Clunky automation setup. Importing automation templates can be a bit cumbersome. Outdated signup form builder. The user interface for creating signup form feels outdated and less intuitive compared to the landing page builder. So all in all, Aweber is a solid marketing tool with a long history in the industry. It offers a comprehensive set of features, but it comes at a higher price and with some limitations. So if you're just starting out or you need a tool with extensive automation and better deliverability, then you might want to consider some other options. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. If you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos just like this. And if you do want to get started with Aweber, we do have some links down in the description to go ahead and get started today. Other than that, thank you so much again for watching. We'll see you next time.